Welcome to the Cobblestone video tutorial on using the Support Ticketing Center. There is likely a time at which you may need to reach out to Cobblestone for help. Rest assured, we're here for you. If you're a system administrator, please reach out to us directly. If you're an end user and not an administrator, please contact your organization's Cobblestone admin. Our preferred means of support is the Support Ticketing Center. If you're unable to log into Cobblestone, please call or email. The email address and phone number will be available at the end of this tutorial. To access the Support Ticketing Center from your Cobblestone application, navigate to the Help menu. Your menu may look a little different than mine. We're looking for the Cobblestone Support Center menu item. Out of the box, it lives right here in the Help menu. I've made a sub-menu for Cobblestone Support, so I'll click that. There's the item I need. Cobblestone Support Center. Let's click it and head on in. Click the link provided to access the site. Your credentials are passed from Cobblestone to the Support Center for login. My credentials are present, just hidden, since you don't need my information to log into your support portal. Click Continue. The Support Center's main page has a ton of useful information. We can add a new ticket or work with existing tickets. One common type of ticket is a request for new functionality, a feature request. It looks as if I and the people in my organization have entered three that are in process. Let's click the carrot to take a look at those items. Here, we can see the subject, the ticket ID reference number, and a snapshot of the status of the ticket. Since they can take some time to review, I'm not too concerned with my feature requests right now. Let's close this list by clicking the carrot again. I'm more interested in my support items. Like with any other area, we'll click the carrot to view the list of tickets. I can see from the overview that I have one open ticket. As we look at the list, we can see it as open. Cobblestone is hard at work on that ticket and will let me know when my issue has been resolved or if they need more information to recreate my error. We can see a list of all the tickets I and others from my organization have submitted with Cobblestone. These tickets may be ones entered by my organization or ones Cobblestone entered on our behalf due to placing a call or sending an email to the support team. We can always look back at any of our tickets. To look at the details of a ticket, click the subject. At the top of the ticket, we can see the subject, ID, type, priority, status, and category. We can even see when the ticket was submitted and when the last response was posted. If we scroll down the page, we can see the full conversation held for the ticket. If applicable, we can even access any attachments. Since this issue has been resolved, let's head back to the main page. The top menu in the Support Center works just like the one in Cobblestone. We'll click the Support Center option from the top menu. Our menu opens. We want Support Center, but before we click that, please note the other options available here, My Assigned Tickets and Release Notes. Access just your tickets from My Assigned Tickets and open the list of all Cobblestone version release notes from the Release Notes item. Now, let's click Support Home. Now that we've seen how to work with existing tickets, let's take a look at creating a new one. We'll click Add Ticket. Our new ticket pop-up displays. Let's open the area selection to review the types of tickets we can enter. It looks as if we can enter support tickets based on our agreement with Cobblestone, feature requests, and implementation tracking tickets. As mentioned earlier, feature requests are to ask Cobblestone to design a new or expand upon an existing function in the application. We build many of our new features based on client input. Implementation tracking is a ticket you likely will not need to create. Those tickets are used to share progress regarding an open implementation of the application. The Cobblestone implementation team uses these to share the implementation plan and to keep tabs on the configuration status. If we want to file a ticket for a support item, we want the top option. It's selected by default, so you do not need to open this list each time you enter a new support ticket. Next, we need to specify a priority for our issue, so we'll open the priority list. We can select among low, medium, high, and critical. Critical is only used when your system is down. 
We'll select medium for this example. Next, we'll let Cobblestone know the kind of problem we're having. To do so, we'll open the type list. Select the best description of the trouble. We'll go with issue for our example ticket. Next, we'll tell Cobblestone the part of the application with which we're experiencing difficulty. To do so, let's open the category list. Now, we can select the area in Cobblestone with which we are experiencing trouble. For our example, we'll select Field Management. Next, we'll give our ticket a title. It should be a brief description of the trouble we're experiencing. Then, we can describe our issue. Provide as many details and steps followed as possible. Cobblestone support will try to recreate your issue, so your description is invaluable. We'll scroll down the new ticket a little. If at all possible, provide screenshots, error logs, or any other relevant files by clicking Select and using your file browser to attach the appropriate file or files to the ticket. Finally, click Submit. Our ticket is immediately fired off to the Cobblestone support team. We're redirected to the new tickets page in the Support Center. From here, we can view the details and add responses as necessary. In addition to the ticket in the Support Center, we're automatically sent email messages with the details of each response on the ticket through to its point of closure. We can engage with any of our tickets with Cobblestone in this manner. If you're unable to access the Support Center, please email us at support at cobblestonesoftware.com or call us at 866-330-0056. A ticket will be entered on your behalf. Cobblestone strives to meet your expectations and our own exacting expectations for support. For terms of support, please see your contract. Thank you for choosing Cobblestone and for the opportunity to help.